This place is a very unique place because it's perched right up on the hill in Rancho Mirage and it's centrally located in the desert. So you're just 10 to 15 minutes away from downtown Palm Springs. You're also 10 to 15 minutes away from downtown Palm Desert or what we like to call El Paseo Village. And we're right in the middle so we can get to either end of the valley. It just screams kind of like that flashy borderline Hollywood Hills aspect where you have these incredible side-to-side -side panoramic views and you're not missing a beat from all the major rooms. You've got spectacular views of the San Jacinto Mountains all the way to San Gregorio. It's panoramic, it's side-to-side, -side, and you have this gorgeous view of the windmills. Brian just really pushes the envelope when it comes to uh, designing his homes with the water features, with the steel structures, with the organic shapes. Uh, it's very warm, it's very elegant, and the design is so unique and modern that it is sought after by any type of clientele, whether it be domestic, nationally, or internationally. Any buyer who has high class, high taste, will love this spectacular modern design proper. One of the most complimentary elements that you do get included is the membership to the uh, Ritz-Carlton, which is included in your HOA membership. You get the privileges of the pool, of the spa, of the restaurant. You get to live the Ritz-Carlton luxury lifestyle when you live and you're a homeowner at the Murata Estates. So the bar obviously is, is positioned very close to the master bedroom suite. Well, the bar was kind of set up to be part of the entertainment area. Okay. And you know, a house like this, of course, can entertain at least 200 people. Really? No problem. Really? Yeah. yeah, and it gravitates towards this area for when there's a gathering. People yeah. like to be towards the great room and the kitchen and the bar. Now the master bedroom suite has um, the view as well. Oh wow, look at how high this void ceiling is. This is just wonderful. It has the clear story glass above and a nice big room. Yeah, just Massive beautiful. size fireplace. Wow. Pocket sliding doors, great views, it's got everything. One of the things I love about your designs is this here, which is the, the ensuite. It is just beautiful. And it's as if you're outside. Absolutely, the intent here was to have you know, his and her showers, have the outdoor plunge pool, outdoor shower. So this is one big suite. I think, Ed, you know when, on those really warm nights when you're um, really hot in bed, you could always come out here, jump in the pool, and then go back to bed and you're nice, nice and cool, right? Absolutely. Yeah. Be perfect. That, perfect. That's way. a really clever innovation. I like to have things more interesting and get away from the conventional square box. I mean, you can find that anywhere. Yeah. And here, these with the angles and lines and the ceilings with the angled roofs, it makes the house more interesting, adds a lot more architectural significance and things for the eye to look at. That's something that I like to do with um, all of the homes is come up with it doesn't have to be one way or the other, so why not? We can mix curves and straight lines, bold lines, soft lines. It makes it very interesting for uh, anybody looking at it from any angle, any direction. So it's just a unique way to design a home. And of course, to live within the home, it makes it more um, interesting. So the house, um, going on the house uh, to the bedrooms is quite a journey in the sense of it like it's, it reveals itself as it goes. Uh, I don't like to make a house to where it's uh, obvious where the bedrooms are and things like that. So here I did this wide hallway with a media room off to the one side here and then the hallway leads to a narrower area and then that transitions off yeah. uh, to the secondary bedrooms. Almost have a feeling of being separate. This is an entertainer's house. So I mean, um, you kind of want the bedrooms to be invisible so that no one's gonna accidentally walk down there, right? Absolutely. So you've almost like put a barrier that thinks, oh, I, d I shouldn't go past that point. Right. Yeah. right. <laughs> Which I think is wonderful, I really do. So, I mean, how many bedrooms do we have here? This house has uh, five bedrooms yep. and five and a half baths. It has a detached guest house which is two bedrooms and has a living room. It's just a great way to have it detached from the main house. It's fully uh, contained. Somebody has their own key to get in okay. and just enjoy. It's like their own their own private area. <laughs> well, we, well we, should, we should tell people, um, you, we, no one's living here, right, at the moment? No one's living here yeah. at the moment, that's so correct. So the property is for sale? It is available. So um, I guess we need to know price. I mean, what are we looking at? What's it gonna cost us? Today? The price is $5,988,000. Which is great. And all that view is for free. All that view is included. Brian, you've been amazing. Great Thank to you see much. you again. Can't Good to wait see you too. to see what you, what you got next. Thank you.